Today, we're going to talk about how to add the Mention Beagle camera into the Devices tab in Orca Slicer. Let's get started. Okay, so we are going to assume that you already have the Beagle camera set up and working properly. We are also going to assume that you have found the camera's URL from the app on your phone. Now let's get this added into the Devices tab. First, you will need to go to the top left corner where it lists your printer. Right next to the printer name, you will see a Wi-Fi icon. Click on this icon to open up a menu. Under Host Type, you will see several options. Prusa Link, Prusa Connect, Octoclipper, Duet, etc. I don't really think it matters what you choose because you don't have any of these options, you have a Beagle camera. Mine is set to MKS, but like I said, I don't think it really matters. In the box labeled hostname, IP, or URL, type in the IP address you got from the mobile app and you can just leave the rest blank. Now go ahead and hit the test button. It's going to error out because you don't have the device it's looking for. This is okay and expected. Next, click on OK to close this tab and click on the Devices tab. It will ask you to log in. The defaults are admin and admin. I'd suggest you change these to something a little more secure. Once you log in, you should see the Beagle Cam control screen. Now, let's go back to the Prepare screen and slice our file. Once Orca is done slicing, it's time to export your G code. The first time you do this after setting up the device tab, it will say print. Unfortunately, at this time, there is no way to directly send the print to the camera, so you'll have to export the G code to a file on your computer. Change the tab from print to export G code with the down arrow. Now click on export and save the file. Now we can go back to the devices tab. Click on Printable Files. Next, click on Upload and select the file you just saved. Once you click Open, it will upload automatically. When it is done uploading, go to the file name and click on the printer icon at the far right. Your print should start as soon as you click Print. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, consider hitting the like button and leave a comment to let me know. Also, if I missed anything, let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to answer any questions. Happy printing!